is coming down harder right now, I think, than it has all day. I would agree with you. And so you just think ball security has been an issue for Duke offensively throughout this season. And I think, you know, whoever predicts the football best tonight probably has the best chance to win. Going to go for it here on fourth and one. And mishandled. The ball loose. Looked like Wake Forest came up with it. Chase Jones pouncing on that. He recovers the fumble. And the Demon Deacons in business after the turnover. In the driving rain. Newman. Oh, down he goes. He took a nasty hit. Emu Keiji was all over him and took him down from 38 yards. Gets this one in the air. That one is up. And that one is good. That is 29 in a row for him now. And he has been perfect for a long, long time. Julia Johnson finding a seam. He's off to the race across the 40. And there he goes. All the way down the sideline for the Duke Blue Devils. 97 yards. Julia Johnson shot out of a cannon. Warm, comfortable studios. No rain gear required. Here's Durant on a scamper, and he lost it. The fumble is kicked across the 40, and still loose, and finally picked up. Amari Henderson, and a forced fumble by Kobe Davis, and a big celebration on the Wake Forest sideline. They keep going like this. They also do a really good job of taking care of the football. They almost never fumble, for example. It's a very tough catch on the sideline here by Stephen Claude. Just not maybe as efficient in trying to intercept the ball. Certainly not on that occasion. Here's the run, though. The quarterback, Newman, heading for the end zone. He scampers in for the touchdown from 42 yards. Dylan Singleton missed a tackle, and that really cost the Duke Blue Devils. He defended 40 runs. More competitive for Duke. He'll go airborne. He's going for a long strike. He's got Hinton. Hinton with the catch. Gets away from a tackler. He is into the end zone. An electrifying play, 62 yards. And Sage Serrato is out for the season with a shoulder injury. That pocket breaking down a bit. He has nowhere to go, nowhere to hide, and he is taken down. Well, here's Skibo, who has already tied the NCAA record of 30 in a row of two tonight. This from 44 yards, and that kick is good. And he's got the record at 31 consecutive makes. I'm hoping there was a bet there. Harris to throw. He's got an open man. He's got his tight end. Noah Gray will march into the end zone. The job that he's done developing and coaching these players to have that kind of success. Julio Johnson starts from inside the five-yard line. Scampering through a big hole. He cuts back inside. Is he going to do it again? He's off to the races once again. This time, 98 yards. For the second time tonight. First and ten on the carry. Walker, Walker across the five. He's still up into the end zone for a touchdown. 14-yard touchdown run. Break a team that almost never fumbles the football. There's a hole on the left side. He'll bounce, trying to the end zone. He dives. And did he get in? Yes, he's in for the touchdown. Harris last time ran it on fourth down. He's going to run again to his right. He's taken down on the play. Stopped by Williams on the defensive play of the ball game. Wake Forest can begin the celebration. Their first Big Four title since 07, going 3-0 against North Carolina schools this season as they win tonight, knocking off Duke 39-27.